These 15-year-olds are the only students left at their school in the remote Japanese village of Tenei. They'll also be the last ever. Aoi Hoshi and Eita Sato are preparing to graduate. When they do, the 76-year-old Yamoto Junior High School will close its doors for good. No new students have enrolled. Empty classrooms like this are an increasingly common sight across Japan. As the country's population ages and the birth rate plunges faster than expected, school closures have picked up pace. According to government data, about 450 schools close every year. Between 2002 and 2020, nearly 9,000 shut their doors forever. School principal Mikio Watanabe is showing us graduation photos from over the years that hang near the entrance of the school. The number of students visibly drops from around the year 2000. There's no picture from 2022. Falling birth rates have become an issue across Asia, with the costs of raising children dampening birth rates in neighboring South Korea and China. But Japan's situation is especially critical. Births tumbled below 800,000 in 2022, a new record low according to government estimates, and eight years earlier than expected. In 10A, only around 10% of the population is now under 18. Local depopulation picked up speed after the 2011 Fukushima disaster, less than 62 miles away. Falling birth rates and Japan's aging population have only added to the issue. Sato's mother, Masumi, a Yamoto graduate herself, says the school's closure will be a real blow for the area. However, on graduation day, spirits are high. For Yoshi and Sato, it's a happy occasion. But the imminent closure of Yamoto has left the village and the students themselves in an uncertain position. Hoshi dreams of becoming a nursery school teacher. Being able to stay here and do it is looking increasingly unlikely. I'm not